I just want to say a little something here because I'm thinking about it while I edit this. I've always really liked sped up footage and time lapses. I think they're really cool. I love how they look. I've always been a fan. But I think it's important to also share real time video of the process of whatever it is that's being shared. And it's interesting anyway. I don't think it's just something to do out of necessity. As much as I love a time lapse, I also love a really long real time video of someone just doing something. But my point is with how things have changed in recent years, <laughs> look, I'm old, okay? So I see things happen over time and then I think about them. <laughs> but with short form video being such a big deal now, and that often being either sped up footage or cut and edited to be very snappy. I mean, even before short videos were a thing, there was a lot of choppy editing on YouTube too, actually. But anyway, I think quick footage of art and craft processes, especially combined with how we're just like scrolling, scrolling, consuming content rather than actively engaging with what we're looking at, can contribute to a false impression of how long it takes to make things and artists are often not appreciated enough anyway. So I guess my point is just that I was putting a lot of sped up footage in this video because I like it. And then I wanted to also show some real time footage because making art takes time and it's worth it. And you should appreciate the work people put into their craft and you should give yourself grace about how long it takes you to make something. Not everything is fast and snappy and it's good to go slow and work on something for as long as it needs. I just, I think it's good to slow down. Even though I love time lapses and I won't stop using them. <laughs> just finished these guys and as ever I can't remember what I filmed so far <laughs> I've been trying to film what I've been doing for a couple of days and yeah so I don't know what you've seen but I just want to take a moment to appreciate the fact that I've worked really hard the past couple of days and I've got loads done and I should be proud of that because I I feel like the amount of stuff that I got done in the past couple of days, however many months ago, would have been weeks of work. Like obviously it's a good time of year with the days being longer, that always helps. But even just compared to like last summer, I feel like I'm doing better and it feels good. Like there'll be a little list of jobs and I'll be like, oh, that's the stuff that I'll manage to get done today based on, you know, how I've been for the past couple of years. And then I'll get that done, then it only took a little while, and then I'll get a load of other stuff done, and then I get to the end of the day and I'm like, wow, I've done a week's worth of stuff in one day, that's amazing. And yeah, I've had a really productive couple of days and I just wanna take a moment to acknowledge that. So, here we are. <laughs>